pull all the pieces. Yo, what's going on chat? How's everybody doing tonight? Give me one second here to finish setting up. Turn off friend code icon on both of these. There we go. Okay. 
So, last night we left off on Water Blight Ganon. I have been doing a little bit of off uh, stream grinding. Oh no. Stay away from me. Okay. Uh, but yeah, no, we're gonna go finish some more shrines and then go over to the Ritos And help take down that Ganon. Oh, Korok Back here There we go Cool, we can use that Korok seed for more upgrades. Goodbye, Korok. Okay. How far are we from... Yo, what's going on, Avery? How you been? We're getting ready to take on the Rito Village and take down Windblight Ganon. Dude, Avery, I streamed for 13 hours yesterday. That was crazy. It took a lot out of me. Is that a tower? No, that's, um, that's a shrine we need to go to. <laughs> yeah, dude, I'm on a mission right now. Oh, there it is. Okay, hopefully we don't fall to our death because we do not have that much, uh... Well, I don't know. We have a pretty good, I'd say, amount of stamina. How's your streams been, Avery? How's work? Hopefully you had a good Monday. Hopefully was very productive. Oh, <laughs> coincidentally, this is the Rudo place. So we have to go here anyway, so might as well kill two birds with one stone. Is that more than one shrine? It is! <laughs> There's another shrine right there! I hear a stone talus. Leave me alone. Yo, what's going on, Yoshi? Can't complain, same old, same old. Oh no, not the Rays talk. Hopefully that went well. No, my Master Sword broke. Dang it. I blame the keys. Ooh, a hearty truffle though. Oh no you don't. Oh, he skates around like we're playing Jet Set Radio. Oh, that's the greatest reference ever. Um, let me see. Can I do a shout out for Avery? Hold on. Still trying to get Avery to uh, 750 subs. We're getting close to 1.4K though. Yo, what's going on, Emilio? How are you doing today? I hope you had a good Monday. Cass! It's Cass. Our friend. Um, well, that's good to hear. <laughs> Welcome to the other stream. Okay. Uh, we need to go over to the, uh, that shrine as well, but I think it's fine. We're gonna walk right across this bridge and talk with the guy from the Ritos. Oh, chat, guess what I unlocked today? Off stream. Ready for this? Well, bam. He's got some divine beast armor. 
Don't I look cool? <laughs> um, I also have the Va Ruta uh, helmet as well. Bird is the word. Um, I really like the Zant helmet though. There we go. Who needs to take a bridge when you can just fly across? Oh, by the way, Avery, I don't know how I'm doing it today, but I'm running off of three hours of sleep. And I'm gonna be live for like another six hours today. Like, I'm not ending until like 12 or 1 o'clock in the morning. <laughs> and I just finished like a three hour, uh... Yeah, it was like a three hour and 40 minute stream of Mario Kart. I'm probably gonna be feeling this in the morning, for sure. I'm gonna wake up tomorrow feeling like a zombie. Mute the music real quick. What a majestic bird. That kind of looks like Ganon's bird from Wind Waker, no? Interesting. All right, let's head up here. Move out of my way. We have to meet with the top leader. Oh yeah, chat, I finished some shrines as well. So we might as well get some hearts out of it. We have enough to get two more hearts. I did a total of eight shrines off screen. Yo, you really do. Avery, I might make you play Breath of the Wild. I know it's not like your traditional Zelda though. I know my chat wants you to play the CDI one. <laughs> I refuse to let you play that horrible, horrible game, even if it is just for the memes. Alright, we now have 11 hearts. Anything has to be better than Majora's Mask? Dude, I'm so glad you hate Majora's Mask as well. I hate that game, dude. It's so bad. Not bad in terms of like story or anything. I just hate the rush mechanic. The game is way too hard for what it's like made to be. It's a little bit too much of like a Dark Souls vibe and it kind of kills the experience. It kind of looks like Link. Yeah, no, uh, time is your biggest enemy in that game, and that's why I refuse to play it. But I did promise my chat when I hit a 500 subs I was gonna play it. Then I extended it to a thousand subs, and now we've already at like 1300. So I have to play it at some point. Yeah. I'm hoping that we can hit 1400 subs before the 22nd, but I don't see that happening. The 22nd is our stream anniversary, or one year. It'd be sick if you hit 750 and I hit 1400 at the same time. That'd be pretty cool. Um, oh, this is the Rito outfit. You know what? We have 5,500 rupees. We're going to buy this. We're also going to buy the Snow Quill headdress. A thousand rupees for a headdress? What? That's crazy. Crazy expensive. <laughs> oh, 
also Avery. Uh, if you play Breath of the Wild, like if you're looking for a really long a game to really experience and have fun with, Breath of the Wild is your best bet because the game takes like 240 hours to finish the story. And then on top of that, Tears of the Kingdom is like another 300 hours to play. I don't know, man, but I can tell you right now, uh, you're looking at about 240 hours and maybe even longer. Like if you want to play through the DLCs, which are $20 a piece or no, it's 20 bucks for both DLCs. So both expansions plus the main game, you're looking at about 240, like 260 hours. You have to do like 200 shrines, 240 shrines. Let's try this. Oh no, I hate this puzzle. Wait a minute. How do I do this puzzle again? Yoshi, do you remember? I'd be the completionist type in probably 400 hours. Yeah. I mean, look, if you're going to play a game and you're going to invest that much time into it, you might as well be in, in, in it for the long haul. Wait, there's an arrow pointing to where this needs to go. Wait, that works. There's an arrow on them. This one is already pointing in the right direction. This one's only pointed at this one, though. Gotta make them all go off. Oh, you remember this puzzle, Bushido? Good, I could really use your help. Wait, some of these are doing double. Like, unnecessary amounts. I just realized that. Some are pushing air in, way in directions it should not need to be. All right, we have, what, two more left? We have this whole row here, which would require this one to go this way. Here we go. We have three more here. Uh, okay, let's reassess the situation. This one blows this way. This one goes this way. This one goes this way. This way. This one goes down this way. Hmm. That activates this one. Bushido, do you remember the exact directions? You know, this whole row is turned off. Everyone is on except for this one. Unless it's this. Like this one would go this way. 
This one turns on this entire row. Now we're stuck with two again. Maybe I should Google it. What was the name of the shrine? Image. Let's see the top down of all of the correct ones. Oh, that is a blurry image. Oh, wait. Hold on, chat. I see all of these done. Uh, let me, let me double check this. I'm not gonna be able to read chat for now, but that's okay. He's standing up here on top. All right, the two in the back are correct. Two in the middle are correct. So that just means it's these over here that need to be changed. Wait, this one's tilted this way. Oh, they turn blue when they're correct. Yo, we did it. That was the only one that needed to be changed. Easy. Wow, so I really didn't even need that. Yo, Murray, how are you? We're solving puzzles. Oh, I didn't even have to change them all. See, I, I didn't even know I was solving the puzzle. I'm a genius. Well, we got ourselves a spirit orb. Lay has big brain, huge IQ. Yeah. I wish. <laughs> but yeah, no, Avery. I think you should start with Ocarina of Time or Twilight Princess. I think you should go with the OG. Start with Ocarina of Time. Go to Twilight Princess. Then do... Um, Skyward Sword, then Breath of the Wild, then Tears of the Kingdom. I think you should do it in that exact order. Like if we're talking 3D games, because you just started Majora's Mask, which is technically the sequel to Ocarina of Time, I think. Yeah, I was thinking Ocarina of Time. My job uh, be having an on sale for Switch. Let's go. Yeah, no, um... Wait so, you, wait, so your job has, like, keys for, uh, the expansion pass? That's sick. Oh, yeah, I forgot about Link's Awakening. Um, I still need to play through that. I did, like, one or two episodes right before I got sick, and then I stopped playing. Okay, I think we need to climb up to the top of the tower. Wait, this isn't correct. Oh. 
Yeah, it is. This is the um, this is the original theme from Wind Waker. I think we need to go to this one over here to the right. Yeah. Yeah, there he is. It's the owl from Ocarina of Time. No, I'm kidding. He looks like him. Ah, a visitor. Welcome to. Oh, oh! That object on your hip. Could it be? Forgive me. Where are my manners? I am Kennelly, elder of the Rito Village. Now then, is that not a shigasli dangling from your hip? <laughs> oh my! So it's true. That means you must be a champion like Master Ravali, one of the few able to board the Divine Beast Va Meadow. No, what am I thinking? The champions have all been dead for a hundred years. This boy must be a mere descendant, an inheritor of the Sheikah Slate. Ah, forgive me. Champion descendant, if you would listen to this old man's request, you would have my eternal gratitude. I'll listen. Thank you, truly. Now that I know that you have a, the blood of the champion, there is something I must ask of you. How shall I put this? I would like for you to deal with the divine beast Vomero, the giant beast circling above us. Only a chosen one, a champion can stop a divine beast. You must enter the beast and bend it to your will. I tried explaining this to the more headstrong Rito warriors, but they wouldn't listen to reason. Coco raid? We're getting raided? What's going on, everybody? What were you guys streaming? Hope you guys all had a good Monday as well. We are taking on the Rito. Um, oh, Fall Guys. Um, we were taking on... Well, we're in the middle of taking on um, Windblight Ganon. So... At the moment, we're currently at the Rito Village, and we're getting ready to start taking on the giant divine beast. Uh, Tiba and Hearth tried to confront Meadow, but it did not go well, and Hearth was injured. Hi there, Kakarot. I assume you are a Dragon Ball fan? Hope all is well with me? Uh, it is. A bit tired, running off three hours of sleep, but... We move. <laughs> Pokemon Go Charizard, let's go. Welcome on in, everybody. Ellie, that dev, let's go. Um, chat, can I get a shout out for them, please? You guys are gonna have to go to the actual like channel itself, though. Hey, Bushido, can I borrow some of that caffeinated tea? Oh, I should have totally made tea. Teba escaped unscathed, but I fear he now plans to face Meadow alone. Also, for everybody who's new here from this raid, my name is Lay Monster. Uh, I stream basically twice a day. <laughs> um, I mostly do Mario Kart and Smash Brothers open lobbies. I do want to start getting back into Fall Guys again because it's been about a year since I've last played it, uh, as well as some Fortnite open lobbies, so that could be fun. Uh, at the moment, we're taking on Breath of the Wild, as I've already said before, and I plan on taking on uh, some Final Fantasy after this. So if you guys are fans of any of those games, I guess just stay around. Yeah, Epic Games. Be making good games. I gotta get back into Rocket League. Yeah, that's a good game. Man, I haven't played Rocket League since, like, 2019. It's been a bit. Hmm. I mean, I still need to get ready for Rebirth as well. Rebirth already came out and I'm like already behind. My backlog is like super duper large. The Elder doesn't realize that he's talking to Link, a champion, but it's not his fault. It's been over a hundred years for everyone, so he wouldn't know that. Yeah. But yeah, chat, I'm normally very energetic. I just, you know, running off for three hours of sleep has got me a bit off today. 
I dropped you on my community tab. Hope you have an amazing stream. Thank you so much. Can you get something to eat real quick? Nice. Go get some good foods. That's been dumping all over Tifa in that game. Really? Oh, that oh, sipping. <laughs> Bro. <laughs> Autocorrect got you. Dude, that's funny. I have actually been staying out of Zed's stream because I don't want spoilers. So I've been like, I've been popping in for like 10 seconds saying hi and then leaving. Dude, for real, Tifa is amazing. I completely understand why he's simping over her. <laughs> so, um, people from the raid, what game, like, what is your guys' favorite game? And if you guys are into the Legend of Zelda series, what is your favorite Legend of Zelda game? I gotta know. Mine, personally, is Tears of the Kingdom. It, I'm, I'm like, it, I don't know, I'm, I'm kind of stuck in between my old favorite, which was Twilight Princess, and Tears of the Kingdom. I uh, see uh, King Ro is super into Fall Guys. What's your rank in Fall Guys, by the way? And have you tried Stumble Guys? Tiba escaped unscathed, but I fear he now plans to face Meadow alone. As a descendant of the champions, perhaps you can help us. Please, find Tiba. If you work together, you may be able to stop Div Divine Beast Va Meadow. Wait, isn't this, uh, isn't this guy, like, super, like, arrogant for the Rito tribe? If I remember, and, like, he eventually becomes humbled. Stumble Guys is, is, uh, let me see. It's not fun. Fall Guys is better. Yeah, I really didn't understand why they re-released Fall Guys as Stumble Guys. I thought that was kind of strange. Stumble Guys? Is that a parody? It, It's actually made by the same people who made Fall Guys, but they re-released it as like something else. It's basically just a clone. It's really weird. Um, it's It almost feels like a mobile version of the game. Adios. <laughs> uh, never played any Zelda-related stuff besides a remake of Link's Awakening. Yeah, I we were just talking about Link's Awakening. Um, I still need to play through it. Um, but my favorite game is Mario Wonder because I generally like platformers more than dungeon open world games. Huh. So here's my question for you then. Are you into Mario Maker? Because I grew up playing Mario as a kid. I was super into Super Mario 64 and mostly uh, Super Mario Bros. Wii. I'm weird. I like that game. A lot of people didn't like that game, but I personally did. You love Mario Maker too. Um, I actually want to kind of get into Mario Maker, but it seems like very jarring and hard to get into. It's how it's very intimidating is, is the word that I'm looking for. Mario Wii is the best. Ah, see, Yoshi is right there with me. Um, I never played the Wii U version, like the, the Super Mario Bros. Wii or Wii U or it is Super Mario Bros. U. I think it is. I don't know. It came in a green case or, or was it Luigi? Yeah, it was one of those. I bought that game and it's still sealed in plastic. Like I never even took it out of the case to play it. I actually have um, Super Mario Odyssey and the 3D collection that I need to um, I need to play through. Although I think it needs more stuff to really be the best it could be. I agree. I would love to see a third one come out. I feel like Mario Maker 2 has been it's starting to show its age a bit, right? It's getting kind of outdated. I've been wanting Nintendo to make like a Mario Kart maker or even like a, a Legend of Zelda ma a dungeon maker for like the longest time, but I know we'll never truly get it. Everyone in the village is freaking out because of it, but I have bigger problems. My mom is so annoying. She asks me to help out at the store every single day. I can't take it anymore. 
I don't want to just help. I want to open my own store and sell whatever I want. Interesting. Interesting, Fison. You should probably start selling dice and vacuum cleaners since your name is Fison. Just change the first letter. You might, you might not get sued. We technically got a Mario Kart maker. Remember Mario Kart Live? What? Mario Kart Live? I didn't even know that was a thing. Really? We actually ended up getting a Mario Kart maker? That's sick. I don't understand. It keeps saying that we need to go here, but there's nobody there. It's just a cliff. Unless we need to talk to that guy again. Oh, it's a shop. Uh. Forgive my intrusion, but I overheard you speaking with the elder. It sounds like you intend to help my husband, Tiba, in the fight against uh, Meadow. But to tell you the truth, there is not much I can do for you right now beyond telling you where my husband went. Where did he go? Well, my husband headed to a place called the Flight Range. It's Dronox Pass at the base of Haber Mountains. Yo, what's going on, Oxy? How you doing? It's a place where Rito warriors prepare for aerial combat. I imagine he's gone there to gather weapons for another run at Meadow. As it happens, he has made his way to the flight range on foot this time. If you take off from Ravali's Landing, it's a straight shot to the flight range. Ravali's Landing is a memorial for the Rito champion Ravali. So named in the hope that none might forget the events of that horrible day. Yeah, I already bought it all. I spent like two thousand six hundred dollars or two thousand six hundred rupees. Zelda Princess games are good. Yeah, Twilight Princess is amazing. I need to buy Mario Wonder. Speaking of Mario, I need to start getting into Mario in general. Mario games have always taken a back burner with me. Even though I really like Mario uh, Sunshine and stuff. Speaking of that, <laughs> uh, I started Mario Sunshine and I never finished it. There's a lot of games that I've started on this channel that we just never finished. We need to go back for. Very few can achieve a mastery of the sky. Yet I have made an art of creating an updraft that allows me to soar. It's considered to be quite the masterpiece of aerial techniques, even among the Rito. With proper utilization of my superior skills, I see no reason why we couldn't easily dispense with Ganon. Now then, my ability to explore the firmament is certainly of note. But let's not pardon me. All right, Dad, so thank you so much for hanging out. Forget the fact that I am the most skilled archer of all the Rito. Yet despite these truths, oh, by the way, chat, Smash Brothers tomorrow. Smash Brothers open lobby tomorrow. All because you happen to have that little darkness ceiling sword on your back. I mean, it's just asinine. Unless you think you can prove me wrong, maybe we should just settle this one on one. But where? Oh, I know. How about up there? Oh, you must pardon me. I forgot you have no way of making it up to that divine beast on your own. Good luck sealing the darkness! Descendant? Descendant, are you, are you all right? Mm. My apologies. I fear I have said far too much. Is there anything you can do, or, or, sorry. If there's anything you do not understand, please do not hesitate to ask. Uh, let me see if I can't grab uh, 
Kakarot's link, by the way, for that raid. All right, so it's Kakarot Gaming XP. Yo, the Kami house. Oh, that's sick. It's live seven days a week. Chat, go sub to Kakarot. Wait, why does it say a link to the desktop? That's weird. <clears throat> oh, chat, they're playing through... It looks like... Here's the kingdom and Pokemon Scarlet. Let me see here. Facts. Also, chat, go follow Avery. Get this man to 750 subs so he can start playing a new Zelda game. Remember, chat, if he doesn't hit 750 subs, he has to, he has to continue to play Majora's Mask. And that game's horrible. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> no, that game's not that bad. I haven't played it since I was a kid. I shouldn't be saying it's bad. Because I have I literally haven't touched the game since like the early 2000s. Okay, uh she said to just fly straight through the valley. So that's what we're gonna go do. It's torture, but please don't tell Papa. Papa lurking right now. When's your next mini goal lay? Um, like mini goal like is in likes or like in subs? What do you mean like the next like sub goal for the next game that we play? <clears throat> Oh, subs. Um, preferably, I'd like to get the next 30 subs up and uh, get to 1,400. Preferably before the 22nd. Like, fingers crossed that we do that before my one-year anniversary. Oh God, is it going to be a collab stream with me and Avery just doing Majora's Mask? Yes, I am evil. No. <laughs> well, currently chat, we are at this many subs. We're at 1,378 subs. We are so close to hitting 1,400. Uh, that will be Saturday, Oxy. I have to figure out exactly, um, I need to figure out exactly how we're going to, like, structure that. Because, I, I mean, I could always just do a Google Doc, like a, like a Google Docs document. Okay, let me pull up, uh, the Zelda music again.
No ads. Ugh. I hate YouTube ads. All right, we're going to be playing double music until we leave the Rito area. Yo, Beetle! It's our friendly neighborhood Beetle. <clears throat> What's going on, man? Dude, Beetle called us broke last stream. Get out of here. Don't worry, Beetle, I'll save you. Ha! Ha! Beetle, you owe me a hundred arrows right now for free. <laughs> he gave me an ancient arrow instead. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> uh, oh no, Marie, please don't torture me like this. It's the guy for Smash Bros. Very true. What's going on, Riley? What's up, Riley? How are you doing? Um, it's funny how the order is reversed in Tears of the Kingdom. What have you got? Let's see. Yeah, I want all of your arrows, please. Like every single one. Wow. Like you see that quill over there? Fill it up. I want them all. I mean, Avery, are you looking for like a long play? Like, are you like looking for a game that can fill up like your needs for content for a while? Because Breath of the Wild is definitely the kind of game and Tears of the Kingdom. Like, like I said before, they're, they're, they're very long games and it's a whole lot of exploring and grindiness. But it's also just like one of those games where it's like storming outside and you just want to chill and play something that's cozy. To me, Breath of the Wild meets that, like, criteria. Uh, don't hit me. Okay, cool. Get wrecked. There's a tier list that you can edit of, on every Smash character in the tier list website. Yeah, I love being able to just one-shot people with, uh, with this Master Sword. I feel like a boss with it. Okay, this looks like the area. Wait, where's the training grounds? Uh, Oxy, sadly, uh, you're not able to post the link because um, YouTube doesn't allow it. I don't understand. We, we passed through the valley, so where's that at? Yeah, it does. YouTube doesn't allow links. Um, all hyperlinks just go to like the abyss, basically. What's funny though is if you're if you have that little blue uh, wrench next to your name, like mods and the streamer are able to post it, but viewers cannot. Yo, spicy peppers. We could use those. Uh, chat. Where do you guys know where the actual area is? So we were we were up there originally, and she said fly in between the rocks.
Wait, they said in between the, the Hebrew mountains, right? <clears throat> oh, wait, there's a... There's a thingy here. It's marked. You said to go this way. Okay, so just put on our, our winter gear. Midair. There we go. <laughs> Alright, so we should be uh, not able to die from cold. That's the area we need to go to. Yeah, it is. Very true. And I still need to do the, uh, the whole world of light stuff. Cobbling off of his horse? <laughs> What's that? No shot. Hold on. I just gotta take care of somebody. Get out of here. Oh no, I killed the horse. No. No. Chat. No. Dang, but cobbling, you made me kill the horses! That's an oh my god, you killed Kenny moment. Yeah, no, literally. We made it to the shrine. Yeah. All right, we made it. Turn off the music. Good thing we bought those arrows off a of beetle, huh? <clears throat> Actually, pretty busy here. You should probably go. <clears throat> what if I don't want to go? Hmm. You need something? I'm busy here. I can help you. Hmm? Help me? With what exactly? Vameto. Let me get this straight. Some random Hylian. Wants to help me bring down Divine Beast Va Meadow. I'm not buying it. What's your name, stranger? I'm Link, the one and only. Link, huh? Well, Link, I'm Tiba. 
But you already knew that. I'm guessing the Elder asked you to come here and talk some sense into me, am I right? That's right. Just like the Elder, to trust any fool wandering into town. Look, you seem like an alright guy, but let's make one thing clear. I'm not going anywhere. As a Rito warrior, I, can, I can't rest until my people are safe. There's only one way I'm going back to Rito Village, and that is... Huh. Once Divine Beast Va Meadow falls from the sky. If I have to kill Meadow, so be it. Only then will I return to the village. Then let's get started. Are you serious? Hm. Ha! Well, far... Wait, far be it from me to talk to you off the ledge. What? Okay, I think I'm getting tired because I just messed that reading up. But it's as, as the elders said, the only way to stop Divine Beast Va Meadow is to get inside it. Fat chance of that happening. There's no way we can set foot in Meadow. Actually... So not only are you wingless, you're brainless too. Let me fill you in. The only people able to enter the Divine Beasts are the five champions of old. And unfortunately for us and the rest of Hyrule, they all died a hundred years ago. If it hadn't been for Ganon, never mind. Let's focus on bringing down Meadow one step at a time. If we approach Meadow recklessly, its cannons will blast us out of the sky before we can get close. So I'm going to need you to... Uh, oh my god, why can't I read today? So I'm going to need to test you before I can take you with me. Oh, I do see Tolan. I do. I can see it. We Rito warriors use the updraft in this ravine to hone our aerial archery skills. The updrafts are so strong here that a person could just open up a cloth over their head and float up easily. Hmm. Now, let's see what you're capable of. You'll have to maneuver through the air and destroy five of the targets set up in this valley in three minutes. I'm ready. Hmm. I'm more than ready. Wait, I only killed five. Did he need eight targets? Mm. Uh, you're a skilled archer. It was as if time stopped with every arrow that you let by. I've got to tell you, Link, when you first showed up, I thought someone was pulling a prank on me. But after seeing you handle that bow, I can tell you're the real deal. You must have seen a battle or two. Hundreds of them. Hmm. I believe it. Link, I feel I've heard the name somewhere before. Oh, only five. Uh, Tiba did figure out Link is a champion. It was a shame they didn't use him in Tears of the Kingdom. Well, if you really want to help me bring down Meadow, it's now or never. I'll get you into position so you can give the, its cannons all you've got. Inside that treasure chest is a bow I've modified. Take it and let me know when you're ready. Uh, we need to drop an item out of our inventory. Uh, where is it at? This level 9 bow can go. We'll swap it out for this one. Or not, this is also a level 9 bow. Save? Yeah, I got you. Oh, 
Oh, that's the Falcon boat, but our inventory is full. I'd use that one uh because they give it to you for a reason okay hmm. okay it's time to face the vine beast vomito and on that note i'm actually gonna go take a one minute break and go grab a glass of water because my throat's becoming dry so i'll be right back I'm back. Okay, it's time to face Divine Beast Vomito. Sorry, I had a yawn. Normal arrows won't put a dent in those cannons. You'll need to hit them with bomb arrows. These are a precious commodity, so don't expect me to do this again, but take these bomb arrows. Cool. Also, it'll be cold up there. You'll want to make sure you prepare a warm meal or bring some warm clothes. I'm ready. Hmm. All right. But let me ask you something. Why are you doing all this? Why risk your life to bring down Meadow? Rito Village? It's not like you'll get the keys to the village, you know. Well, that's nice, but... No changing your mind once you get up there and see Meadow up close. That's far- or that's fair enough. Right. Get on. Here we go. It's showtime. Good luck. Why am I going to need it?
right, let's go. All right, it's showtime. Man, even I feel like I'm going to freeze up here. There's Divine Beast Vomero. It has its barrier up again. What a pain. What's wrong, Link? Too scared to talk? Let's go over the plan. You see those cannons? I'll draw their fire near. While I'm doing that, use your bomb arrows to destroy the cannons. Got it so far? Yo, Keegan! Jeez. If you need to withdraw for a bit, just spread your cloth and float straight up in the updraft for a while. Chat, this is my first time ever taking down this boss, so I have no idea what I'm going up against. <laughs> I'll take that as a sign we need to, to regroup. Don't bother aiming for anything covered by Meadow's barrier. It's impenetrable. And whatever you do, do not get close enough to touch it. And finally, I know I've said this a few times already, but don't forget your cold protection. Let's go. We can move when you're ready. All right. Now let's go destroy those cannons. It's on you. Be careful. Go. It's targeting us. You really enjoyed this one? had to shut down the store early because the inside temperature got down to 40. Dang, dude. One more. Do they have a technician coming up to fix your, your heaters at work or no? Oh, don't worry, Oxy. I already read that. Yo, what's going on, Retro? We're taking on some Zelda Breath of the Wild today. Okay, that was really dumb. I don't know why that, uh, he got in my way. <laughs> there we go. Your stream's been retro. And how was your St. Patty's Day? Uh oh. Is he about to faint? Bad news, Link. It looks like I got hit pretty good back there. I think... I think I need to get back to the flight range. I just hope that I can make it back. You head down to Meadow. Good luck. It's all you. 
Enjoy your fire then, Bull Moxie. Appreciate you hanging out. Travel gate registered to map. Well now, I've seen that face before. I had a feeling you would show up eventually, but making me wait a hundred years is a bit indulgent. My question is, is how do they know it's been a hundred years? Like how have they been keeping track of time? You're here to wrest control of Meadow away from Ganon, correct? If so, then the first thing you'll want to do is find yourself a map. That guidance stone has the information for the layout of this divine beast. Can you make it there? Okay, let's go get our map. There we go. Get out of my way. The spirit has been trapped all this time in the divine beasts, so they obviously have been able to see the changes. So basically they became one with the the actual divine beast itself. Also, Revali is sassy? Yeah. Speaker Slate activated. Stealing map of divine beast. Divine Mr. Beast. Divine Beast controls have been mapped, okay? You'll need to look closely at your map of the Divine Beast. The terminals that will activate Meadow are marked by those glowing points. You'll need to activate all of the terminals to take back control. Think you're up to it. Okay, seems easy enough. Uh, let's see. We're on each side of the wing. And this seems to work. Yo, what's going on, Papa? Oh, what? <laughs> that was really dumb. Why didn't it go with me? It just shot out from underneath Link. Huh? 
So how's your day off going, Papa? Okay, I think we can get back up from here. Oh, no, that sucks. No! Oh, Papa, you came in both of the chats. I didn't even notice that you were on the, the short side. He gets so close, yet so far. There we go. Perfect. It was a lot harder than it needed to be. Looks like this pin needs to be pushed in. Interesting. So we need to get this gate here to go up. Oh, I wonder if that's what we need to get to. see there we go ah, I'm sorry to hear that you're having issues with your app That's one down. Four more to go. Oh no, five more to go. Take a sleep authenticated. Terminals remaining. Still. Still ways to go. Alright, we have one more over here behind this gate. Ice arrows.
How do we get this gate to open? Uh, chat, any ideas? Is this a TikTok stream or something? No, it's a YouTube short stream. But welcome. Um, hopefully you had a good Monday. A nice productive Monday. Um, we're taking on Varuta today. It's the... Um, it's the next divine beast in Breath of the Wild. We're saving the Ruta. The Ruto? Rito tribe? Yeah, Rito. I keep mispronouncing their name. Okay, so it seems we need to drop down here. Then position our waves. Fob Meadow. Okay, thank you. <laughs> that was yesterday's. But yeah, how are you doing? How are you doing today, uh, Doctor Dread? I apologize, Dread. I'm running off with three hours of sleep, so. I've got a little bit of, uh, poo brain right now. <laughs> My brain is not there currently. Okay, so this opens up this door here. No, their name is Dr. Dread. Yeah, I play Breath of the Wild. Amazing game. So here's my question for you. Because I've never beaten Breath of the Wild, but I played it back in 2016 or 2017. Um, what's your favorite Zelda game? Mine personally is uh, Twilight Princess. Like out of all of the Zelda games that I've played, and I've played a lot of them. Let's hit this uh, area here. Oh, it's 4 a.m. here and you just woke up? Dang. Well, good morning. <laughs> Can we grab that ledge? No, dang it. Uh, what if I jump from up here? Yeet. There we go. So what's, uh, what, what was your favorite, um, divine beast, Dread? There are three terminals remaining. Keep going. Three terminals remaining. Okay. Oh, by the way, Dread, there's also a 1920 by 1080 stream. If you go to my channel and click on my, like, profile picture, you'll see a second stream. If you go there, all of the rest of my chat is over there. And um, you'll be able to see the full game instead of having it in, like, a, a phone screen kind of way. I've not tried other Zelda games, only Breath of the Wild. You're currently on Tears of the Kingdom. Okay. Um, Tears of the Kingdom was probably my, one of my favorite ones. Like, it, it almost tops Twilight Princess for me. But, Dread, I'm telling you, nothing beats the traditional Zelda games. You should totally play through Breath of the Wild, or not Breath of the Wild, um... Through Twilight Princess, Ocarina of Time, Majora's Mask. But yeah, no, how, how far are you in Tears of the Kingdom right now? Let's see. We have... Wait, oh wait, we can turn the bird!
Uh, Fave Divine Beast, I'd say La Rudania. Um, isn't that, that's either... I think it's the Gerudo one, right? With the Thunder Helm? Okay, we'll make the bird go back. Oh, it's the lizard. Okay, I believe that's the... Oh, jeez, that's the one from... The Elden one, right? From the Gorons? Okay, we need to go over to the other wing. Back over here. Bruh. Oh wait, there's a thing here. Make the bird drop and then grab our bow. Stasis. Yeah, I should have done that. It's okay. We just go ahead and bring the bird back up. Although Link is starting to uh, glitch out, though. Got it. Then immediately drop it back down. Here we go. Bam. Cool, we made it. Activate this one. And that should hopefully open the gate and let us out. There are two terminals, two terminals remaining. remaining. Which means, I wonder, there's a second one on the other bottom floor. Yo, what's going on, Triforce? There is. He Bruh, what's going on, man? Chaos time, madness, oh no. Just one terminal remaining. <laughs> what do you know? All right, let's go ahead and swap this over. Oh, wait, no. Maybe we should make it back to station, stationary? No, we want it to fully go to the other side so we can fly back without dying. That bad, huh, Triforce? Oh, wait, uh, I think we just died. Oh, wait, hold on. We might not die just yet. Oh, it was fun as heck. That's great. You know what's not fun as heck? Me dying right about now. Yep, it's over. Oh my god, I'm gonna need the keys to that Tesla. You can only borrow it on weekends, okay? <laughs> no, Renee! Friday, or Monday through Friday, it's all mine. Those are the rules. <laughs> and it must be car washed before Monday. Those are also the rules. That's Gaff. <laughs> seats, or the seats must be steamed too. And no cheaping out either. 
I'm talking full on rainbow foam with the with the turtle wax. Yo, John. Okay, we have one more left, but I just don't know where it is. Oh, it's in that room. <laughs> Are you trying to tell me you're going to wash the car with, with dish soap and it's just going to get destroyed? You're just going to strip all of the paint coating off? Are you still alive, Triforce? Um... Need to go this way? Yeah. So use the air. Dang it, it's the... I wish there's a better way to control Link. No, I'm just gonna have a whole bunch of rabid dogs lick it clean, <laughs> bro. That's dirty. That's so messed up. Well, for the twenty dollars of McDonald's to throw into the car to trigger it. Oh, that's diabolical. Just park it on the side of some random street somewhere. Open all the car windows so all the raccoons can just come inside the car. McDonald's sounds so good right now. I know. You know what else sounds really good right about now? A Dunkin' Donuts coffee. But it's too cold and I didn't want to bother uh, door dashing and having some door dasher go and get me a coffee. I also didn't feel like it was right for me to be paying $19.17 for one single coffee from Dunkin' Donuts. Like it's like nineteen seventeen. Um like after taxes. Ah, oh, good two chocolate donuts. And you didn't share. Oh, I thought we were friends. <laughs> nah, but I bet you they were pretty good, huh? They have some really good chocolate, like blueberry donuts at Dunkin' Donut that are so good. How do I open this area though? It's like blocked off. Um, maybe tip it sideways? Yeah, I do the same thing. I used to eat them quite a bit, and then... I started to become very unhealthy. I felt unhealthy, so I just stopped eating donuts altogether. Okay, I see it. Oh, that's what we got to do. Wait for it. Blam. But blam. And then push that one through. Yeah. Now we just have to tip it forward. Can I grab that with stasis to this wall? All right, now tilt it back forward again. Yo, I can grab it through the wall? That's sick. All right, now tilt it backwards again. Wait, wrong way. Whoa!
Did I just get the ball stuck? No, I didn't. Okay, here we go. Uh, stasis. Um, you can use stasis to get that back. Oh, okay. Yes! Let's go! Final one. Terminal. Now you just need to start the main control unit. All right, I time to start to the main control one. Here we go. Wait, chat, the music changed. This is your favorite boss? Oh yeah, you're right, save the game. I feel like this one's just gonna be a piece of cake, just like the water blade Ganon. We're gonna beat this one super duper easily. Unless Tropic, should I not use the Master Sword for this? Should I wait? That way it gives me a chance to die a few times? Or no? To me, okay. Good luck. That thing is one of Ganon's own, and it plays dirty. He defeated me 100 years ago, but only because I was winging it. I can't believe I'm actually saying this. You must avenge me, Link. His aim is dead on. Watch yourself. Uh, his aim is dead on, yet he's missing my shots. Or he's missing his shots. Okay, he didn't miss that one. Pro tip, don't die. Duly noted. Whoa, he can create wind. I forgot about that. Ow. Okay, we might actually die here. I can't be uh, messing around. Samus, calm down. Wait, why hasn't he fell to the ground and got knocked out yet?
Leo says hi. There we go. All right, chat. Master Sword, rest of the way. We should be able to one-shot him. Let me just call him Mega Man. Wait, he's got torpedoes? Shouldn't Water Blight Ganon should have had that? All right, chat. Say goodbye. <laughs> One hit took out all that damage, all that health. Goodbye. Goodbye. Wait, I can't throw uh, lasers at you? Okay, fine. And final hit. Goodbye. Wait, use the lens of truth. Dude, you do, Triforce. But Triforce, I went and did the the champions, uh, I think it's the champions battle DLC. So my Master Sword is upgraded. So it does 60 damage when it's around um, Malice and or um, Guardians. But 30 damage on regular enemies. Oh yeah, but no, using the Master Sword early, like in general, makes a huge difference. Yeah, I finished the sword trial. I did it in my free time off stream. Because I wanted to progress through this faster. Here we go. We got our heart piece. Let's go. I used a bunch of speedrunning tactics to get through it faster. Well, Triforce, you need to replay through it then. Three heart challenge, Breath of the Wild. <laughs> We can always change the rules there, uh, Triforce. You still wish to activate it? Yes. Uh, Triforce, do you know that bug in the game? where you uh, drop a, literally a bunch of bows on the ground and Link's model like disappears. Well, if you do it in a certain way, you can actually break the game. A lot of speedrunners use it to like duplicate bows and stuff, but I use it to do other wacky stuff. Rivali. Well done. I suppose I should thank you now that my spirit is free. This returns Meadow back to its rightful owner. <laughs> Don't preen yourself just for doing. Yoshi, you mean ravioli? I do suppose All right, I'm, I'm gonna stop. Your value as a warrior, <laughs> a warrior worthy of my unique ability, the sacred skill that I have dubbed Ravali's Gale. Ravioli's Gale? All right, now I'm gonna stop. Ravioli, give me that formioli. Raffioli it's gas. now time to move on and Call him Raffioli <laughs> But only if you think you'll still need my help while you're fighting inside Hyrule Castle. Feel free to thank me now. Or never mind, just go. Your job is far from finished, you know. <laughs> Listen, I'm still waiting on that formuli from Mr. Ravioli. Has been waiting an awful long time. He's been waiting a hundred years to give me that formuli for that ravioli. Listen, chat, you can't be cringe if you own it. Remember that. Uh, <laughs> Rivali should not be uh, talking if he died to a pink goop with a gun.
But yeah, no chat. Is this not the bird from Wind Waker though? It looks like the giant bird that we fought in the in the actual um oh, what was the name of the prison? We'll just call it Ganon's prison. The fortress. There we go, the fortress. Ganon's fortress. Is that what it's called? Yeah, the Forsaken Fortress. It looks like Ganon's bird from the Forsaken You'll Fortress. Have a precise speed on Ganon from this vantage point. And when the time is right, give him everything you've got. Now we wait for that perfect moment. <laughs> Meadow, we've been artfully patient for the last 100 years. I doubt you'll suffer a feather over a few more moments. After all these years, I simply must admit the truth. Even without the power of flight, Link made his way to this divine beast and accomplished something that even I could not. I guess I was wrong about how lucky he would be. I hope that luck holds out, Link, for everyone's sake. Let's go! We've got the Ravioli's Gale! Now we can fly anywhere. The only question, chat, is is it Chef Boyardee? Because if it's not Chef Boyardee, then I don't want it. Pass <laughs> the <to> Gale. <laughs> Chat, I'm tempted to go have Ravali uh, put on the front of the can of the chef of the chef party. <laughs> Chat, somebody do that. <laughs> put him on the front of a can. Replace the old man with 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 uh, with Ravali. I think you should do Gerudo next. Okay. I can't find uh, Kahil anywhere. Where could she be? Maybe she went to Warbler's Nest next to, or to practice her singing. Oh yeah, that's way over there where that, where that tombstone. You'll do that, uh, Riley? All right. Give me one second here, chat. Oh yeah, you're right. It is from Woman Waker. Sorry, chat. I 
I got a DM I had to reply to. Okay, now go see baby Tolan. Wait, Tolan's in here? Where's baby Tolan? I must find Tolan now. It is now my life's mission. Uh... Tolan? Hey! Tolan! It's our boy! <laughs> great kids are great greeters. That's what my dad always says. Dad fi finally came back from work. But it sounds like he got hurt. But he says he's gotten a lot better, so he'll be able to me, uh, take me flying again soon. Come back later and play with me. All right, Tolan. Wait, here's the dad. You, I really owe you for what you did. Are you hurt? It's fine. Wait. Why a dude in on the side look like a tribal joke? <laughs> No, you just violated him. <laughs> you know what? Now that you mention it, he does kind of look like a chocobo. Yeah, now I can't unsee it. Dang it. Chat, do you agree with Triforce? It's fine. Thanks to my wife, I've recovered to the point to where I can stand. Actually, my wife told me something about you. She says you're a descendant of the champion. Hmm. Ha ha! Go on, there's nothing to hide. Your bowmanship, the way you move through the air, there's no doubt about it. You have the blood of a champion. What? You look like you've got something to say. Actually, don't tell me. You're the Hylian champion. Ha 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 ha! Good one, pal. Everyone knows that, that all of the champions were wiped out by Calamity Ganon a hundred years ago. And even if they survived that, they'd be old geezers with canes instead of swords. I let the Elder know about what happened with Divine Beast Vomero, but you should probably go talk to him. He doesn't believe us. Interesting. By the way, chat, that's definitely the old uh, owl from Ocarina of Time, right? Or am I tripping? I, is that... That's, that's definitely him, right? You've done it. You've conquered at that. Or so you've survived at that. You conquered Divine Beast Vameta. He eventually figures it out. To think the beast has taken up roost at the top of the village. It simply looks divine. <laughs> he really let himself go. I'm dead. Chat, if you know what, Triforce makes a good point. He did let himself go a bit. If the legends are true, the light from the divine beasts will ravage the calamity. For now, wait, so are you, are you telling me that Ganon is allergic to lasers? To infrared? Really? Red infrared lights? LEDs can stop Ganon. Hmm. Who would have thought? For now, Divine Beast Vameto will become the protector of this village and live on the on in legend alongside you. Oh yes, of course. I must reward you properly. Gets VCR remote. <laughs> Feel free to take what you need in that chest. Uh, you will get more use out of it than I. Champion Descendant. I have only just realized that sword you have in your possession. Could it be that sword that seals the darkness? The Hylian Champion who fought alongside Master Rivoli a hundred years ago. Could that be you? It is me.
the Great Eagle Bow. Honestly, I will take that bow, because that bow is like 10 times better than all the other ones that I have. Bows. Bro, getting dialogue way earlier than normal. Yep. It is a really sick bow, though. Uh, where's it at? This one. Oh, by the way, chat, I still have a Lionel bow. Which allows me to shoot multiple arrows. Yeah. I don't own it on Switch. I have the Wii U version. Alright, chat. Let's go figure out what this side quest is about. My controller getting stick drift? Oh no. No, this is no good. Really? After like 10 years, my controller is finally getting stick drift? Like the camera just went yeet inwards. Oh, there it goes! Oh no. No! <laughs> Why now? Well, chat, here you go. Here's your new gameplay. You get to stare at the sky forever. Oh, wait. As long as they don't touch the right stick, we're good. That's great. You probably just need to recalibrate it, probably. Or resync it back to the Wii U. What happened? My right stick is getting stick drift, and it's just going upwards. <laughs> Imagine you leave for a couple minutes and the stick drift beats the game for you. Yeah, no, this is... I've had this controller for like a solid nine and a half years. And this controller has never once gotten uh, stick drift, so this is bad. Which means I have to buy a third-party Wii U controller, and that sucks. Because Wii U gamepads for 20 bucks on Amazon, I assume are pretty, pretty bad. Okay. The stick drift is gone for now. I press the stick in. Test. Alright, we're good. But it is showing signs that it's going to die at some point. And that kind of sucks. Because they don't make these controllers anymore. Um, chat, do we go straight to the Gerudos now? Or should we go mess around? That's weird. Just found one on eBay, used for about 35 bucks first party. That's actually not bad. Should we go fight a Lionel? All right, let's go fight a Lionel. Where's the Lionel's at? Oh, 
Oh wait, chat, before we do anything, before we do anything, last night before we ended, because I was I was up at like 3 o'clock in the morning playing Breath of the Wild, we need to finish the, the lab here. And I need to light the blue flame and bring it to the lab, but I don't have a torch. I should be able to find a torch at the old man, right? Uh, at the Shrine of Resurrection. Hmm. Let's try it. Yeah, we need to get a torch. At best condition for first party on eBay will run you about 50 to 75 bucks. Yeah, that's steep, dude. I, I bet you it would be cheaper if I just took the first party controller apart and just swapped out the stick box. Desoldered it and then just resoldered it a new one on. I could probably get a pack of new stick boxes for like four dollars off of Amazon. They might be third party, but at least it's cheaper than spending like 35 to 75 on a controller. Okay, where's the old man at? My Shrine of Resurrection is here, which means old man's base camp would be over here. Right? Yeah. There's the torch. Thanks, ex uh, King of Hyrule. Uh, let's drop the Guardian Spear for the torch. Go all the way back up to the Akala Tower. You know what, Triforce? I'm kind of curious, because uh, I've never owned a Switch Pro controller. I've always used those Power A wired controllers for my Switch. Um, how good is the the Switch uh, Pro controller? Did you have a glider? He's no longer in the physical realm. He's dead. Yep. But yeah, no, I, I just wondered, because I've never actually owned one. I know the, the Xenoblade controllers and stuff back from like 2017 were really cool with like the different colored grips. I've been through two pro controllers. Yeah, that doesn't sound too good. Okay, the research lab is this way. Which means... Well, that's only because I had my first one for about four years. That's not bad. And like... Because we're streamers, we use our controllers a lot more than normal gamers do. Okay, so pro controllers last about four years apiece, duly noted. Dang, Chad, I'm really far away from the, from the research lab. Here, I'll put on some music while we slowly make our way over. So it got some heavy use. Okay. That and I, I feel like mostly uh, the Switch Pro controllers are going to die faster, especially if you play a lot of Smash Brothers Ultimate because you're consistently using your right stick or your left stick to be able to, to do down B. I do, however... Uh-oh. Okay, we survived. I do, however, have a new one that I thought I was going to use to replace the other one, but I haven't needed to. Interesting. Yeah, no, if I buy a Pro Controller, I definitely want one of the limited edition colored ones. I like the Splatoon red and yellow one, or the pink and yellow one was really sick. But those are expensive. Like, the, the Xenoblade Pro Controller goes for like 130 on Amazon. If, 
they ever do a re-release, it'd be sick to own. Oh yeah, you're right. You know what? I can still buy those. Those are still around. I can go buy a Zelda's, Zelda Tears of the Kingdom Pro Controller right now. That'd probably be better than the uh, Pokemon Power A controller that I used for the Switch to play Smash Brothers. You have a wired pro controller for your switch yeah i do as well what's crazy chat is that my uh, i have like the pokemon i think it's a pokemon sword uh power a controller all of the paint on the plastic have completely like it's got like webbing like it's cracked like the the paint is like cracking and having little micro cracks i'll take a photo of it and post it on discord but that's crazy what's happening to that controller though i've never seen something like that ever it's like a, it's like I bought a defective controller. Oh, chat, we need to go fight the Yiga clan tonight. Before we end stream, I want to fight the Yiga clan. That is a must. Ah, Beetle just got electrocuted. And I'm about to as well, if I don't hurry up and put myself away. Get wrecked, Beetle. Well, we're making our way downtown. We're definitely walking fast. There's no faces past. Speaking of which, I need to call it a night. I have to work early in the morning. You're good, Triforce. I see the research lab. Oh wait, we have a bunch of rain here. How am I supposed to take a torch if it's raining? The rain is just gonna take the torch out. <clears throat> Maybe we can sleep inside of the research lab for a minute. <laughs> no problem, Triforce, anytime. energy and power. Oh, we have a blood moon coming. A giant blood moon. Okay, let's try to sleep at the research lab real fast. See if we can't get this rainstorm to go away. I already uh, did this yesterday, so I'm not gonna reread all of the stuff. But he needs Link to take off his clothes, which is an AO moment. Because he needs to see if Link has any scars on his body to prove that he was Link from 100 years ago. Yep, yep, he survived. Dr. Robbie! Alright, this should hopefully start the quest that actually be able to light the flames. Right? Who would have known? Robbie's a creep. Wait, that's kind of a sick backpack. 
<clears throat> okay, now let's see. Bro, there was a torch here the whole time. <laughs> I feel dumb. Uh, I wonder if he's gonna be okay with me lighting a fire in his house. Excuse me, Sir Robbie, can I uh, light a piece of flint? This is if I can find a piece of flint. Do I not have any flint? Oh, this is a problem. <clears throat> well then. I guess we have to just wait out the storm then. Way to go, Homer. Wait, we have a uh, blood moon coming. Wait, what am I thinking? Wait. There we go. We have fire right here. Skip this cutscene. Rain should have stopped by now. And it did. Okay, cool. Now we just have to make our way over here to the flame and light the furnace. There it is. So chat, based off of us doing both of the Divine Beasts in two streams, how much longer do you think we have until we beat this? Like at the, at the pace that we're going. Okay, now it is just a brisk walk back. Without dying. All right, we need to eat. Where's Robbie's research lab at? 
Okay, we need to go this way. Run! We have Bushido, how much longer do you think we have? Until this series is over. I say not much longer. I would say probably another 20 to 30 hours on average. Cause like, I don't know, I've been doing a lot of off stream uh, grinding to get hearts and, and stamina containers. Okay, we might die here. Stay away from me, Bacoblins. Gosh, we're so close. Don't let this Macabre chase after us and hit me. Please. Where's that other... There it is. Cool. Wow, this is a really far away place. There it is, I see it. Like, they really made us work for these upgrades. Not only do we have to grind guardians to get parts, but we also have to walk like 2,500 miles. And there's a guardian. Yeah, no, we're done for. Uh, this might become a problem. You don't see me. I'm just gonna hug the side of this hill and hope that I can get further enough away that I don't get striked by the Guardian. This is where we could buy ancient arrows? 400 rupees is kind of steep. Darling Cherry is back to normal. Such is the power of love. 
I love made cherry well again. The furnace is lit. Oh, well, thank you. Yes, quite. Now then, please take this as a gift of my gratitude now that cherry is fixed. Three ancient arrows, let's go. They are made using secret Chica technology. They have the option, or they have the addition of Maya upgrades. They are morphed into. Anti-calamity weapons, so to speak. Needless to say, they are an incredibly powerful type of ancient soldier gear. I like to call them ancient arrows. In addition to ancient arrows, Cherry can make all kinds of ancient soldier gear. Anti-calamity. If you're looking to acquire some, uh, give your ancient materials and rupees to Cherry. Rubies? Did you hear that? Ah, forgive me, Link. Ever since the fall of Hyrule Castle, we haven't had much in the way of funds for our research. That's why I thought you might be willing to help us out with rupees. Lots of them. I beg of you. But let's do it, hmm? The two of us as soon as possible. Yes, let's conquer the calamity. That also works, Bushido. Yo, this is sick. I need a pair of pants though. Which costs how much? 2,000 rupees? Let's see if Beetle is here. We can just sell him a bunch of stuff. Beetle. There he is. Alright, let's uh, make him go broke. 600 rupees for 100 fish? Absolutely not. Four thousand rupees. I don't know if I want to sell my food, though. It's fine, chat. We can always get more fish. Wow. Yeah. Here we go. We should now have enough to be able to get the rest of the armor set from the ancient tech lab. Let's go buy. Let's go spend all of our money and go broke. Yo, an ancient bow looks sick. What? 
bro. We need ancient cores. Dang it. Oh, well, at least we have the helmet part. We can use the the Va Meadow uh, divine helmet for now. Dude, we look sick. If only we had the Tears of the Kingdom, like super long, like flowy hair. That would make this armor look so cool. But what kind of stats does this give us? Guardian or re uh, resist up. But the issue is that the helmet only gives us um, cold resistance, sadly. But chat, we are now a part of the Zonai. Or Zonai. <laughs> we are now a part of the Sheikah. We are now a Sheikah soldier. With our Sheikah sword in hand. I just don't have the shield or the bow, though, to finish the set. Uh, yeah, let's not do that. Oh, chat, is there still a, um, a Lionel on top of the cliff? Onto the top of Zoro Domain. Like, if we go back to the ruins, right? And we go back to the top, will that Lionel be back there or no? He <laughs> made Revali Chef Boyardee. Oh my gosh. Let me guess, is it in Keegan's chat, in the meme chat? No. Just Fire Nights and Freddy stuff. Okay, let's climb. We can make it. Sorry, I'm messing with OBS stuff. I probably shouldn't be doing that while I'm live. I'll end up breaking something. Yo, I can't believe- Oh, no, it's raining. No! I refuse to die. Wait, now it is? Oh, wait, let me see. <laughs> no shot, chat. That is hilarious. Hold on, let me uh, let me open up in the browser. Copy image. Can I just like copy and paste this in OBS? Here we go. <laughs> Chat. Rally made the chef Bayardie beef ravioli. <laughs> the beef ravioli. <laughs> Wait, this is kind of messed up. Wait, hold on a minute. Because it says beef uh, ravioli, it makes it sound like you're eating ravioli. Oh no. This is hilarious. 10 out of 10. This is so good.
It's gonna stay there now. Right there. Chat, we are sponsored by Chef Boyardee Beef Rivoli from Breath of the Wild. Just kidding. We are not sponsored. Yeah, I think we're dead. No, we're not. Okay, we're good. <laughs> okay, we need to make some food. Because we failed very badly. We need to go make some triple um, stamina food. Good night, Renee. Thank you so much for hanging out. I appreciate you. We're going to go use this cooking pot over here. And I believe we need stamina. I think we gave away all of our stamina fish, didn't we? chat it's fine we can use an amiibo I mean, hey, we got a falcon bow, which is cool. Not what we were looking for, though. All right, we got one stamina bash or bass. Let's see, is that gonna be good enough? Stamina oka bass. What if I mix it with a swift carrot? Is that does that help? Oh, Endura Carrot. Now cook. <laughs> what? That is not what we needed. Chat, we do you know anybody who sells the potion for stamina? We need a stamina potion, chat. Should be enough, right? Or no? Let him cook. Wait, I just realized there's two different sets of music playing. Go back to the tower. Let's see if we can't make it back up to the top, so we can go fight that Lionel. Uh, before we go and fight that Lionel, uh, Marie, are you still in here? Since you were the one who requested us to fight the Lionel. Yo, Jacob! What's going on? Uh, Jacob, everybody else is in the other stream. If you want to hop on over to the other stream, you can. Yeet.
That storm's gonna wreck us again, isn't it? You know what we need to get, chat? We need to get more, um, faster speed. We need speedy clothes. For sure. Yeah, that makes sense. What's going on? But yeah, no, Jacob, how was your day? Smack. All right, let's go fight that Lionel. That Lionel should be up here. Yes, I'm here. Why not to get some McDonald's? Nice. You've been good? That's good to hear. I thought there was a way you could see enemy health in Tears of the Kingdom. Uh, hold on, uh, Bushido. I'm currently getting, uh, shot with, uh, explosives. Okay. Let's go fight that Lionel now. Wait, chat, how do I use Revali's Gale? Hold X. No shot, that's sick. over there or if he's over here This is where the Lionel is, right? Oh yeah, Jacob, what do you think of the armor? I've never had this armor before. It's pretty cool. Chat, which one do you like more? Do you guys like the... The Va... The Va Meadow or the Va Ruta? true and that's like the whole point of like a, a sequel also I cannot find um, the Lionel I don't know if I'm in the right area for it though either this definitely seems like the same area we were at, though. Oh, wait, no, it was over here on top of this mountain. We'll mark it real quick. That's like way over there. Yeah, no, we're way off.
You know, a lot of people often complain about Breath of the Wild being too washed out or too, like, toned down for their liking. I don't know. I, I have to, I mean, I, I get it. I, I understand, like, their opinion is valid. I'm not gonna say it's not, but Breath of the Wild just has, like, a certain art style that's very special. It's like a softer version of, like, what Wind Waker was. Breath of the Wild has amazing graphics, I agree. Yeah, I agree with you. Because there's a whole lot of Breath of the Wild haters and Tears of the Kingdom haters out there. And it, they're, it's mostly like the OG traditional Zelda players. I, I do, I don't know if I, I wouldn't say that they're afraid of change. I just think that they just didn't like the direction that this game went with, which is fine. It's fair. What's going on, man? Uh, ah, ah. <laughs> oh, okay, okay, okay. <laughs> Time out. Time out. Hey chat, how do I flurry rush? I forgot. Do I need to have a shield for that? Oh, I did it! Alright chat, it's like seven hits to kill the Lionel. Seven or eight hits. But that's only because that's an easy Lionel. I feel like if we went after a harder Lionel, I'd probably get wrecked. <clears throat> oh yeah, true, no. If I had a normal sword, I would have gotten destroyed. Uh, Riley, we have the upgraded Master Sword. I definitely almost died there, though. I want to go try a harder Lionel now. Uh, chat, where's the next Lionel? This is bringing me back to when we fought Lionels with no broken fused weapons, no bullet time for shield jump, just skill. I don't know how to feel about that because I, I literally just flurry rushed him. <laughs> Wait, hold on. Wasn't the point of going to the ancient tech lab originally was to upgrade our, our stuff? He never upgraded my stuff. He just scammed me out of 6,000 rupees. We need to go back and get our stasis and stuff upgraded. But like that, that just now crossed my mind. Robbie robbed me. Oh my God, it's in his name. Robbie robbed me. He used me to light the blue flame and then stole my rupees. Robber Robbie robbed me. <laughs> Um, the skull's eye. Robbie's research. I don't understand. Why why can't Robbie just give us our upgrades? Robbie the robber committed robbery to Rob Blink, who has now been robbed. <laughs> that one wasn't good. Oh, by the way, Marie, I don't know if you've seen, but uh, 
Riley made some really cool art. No artificial flavors, no preservatives, and no artificial colors. Only the purest beef Rivoli. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's amazing. Non BPA liner in the can. <laughs> it's it's non GMO. <laughs> Yo, two hundred and twenty calories. That's amazing. Two point five X for for saturated fats in a single fifteen ounce can. Of beef Rivoli? Amazing! <laughs> 10 out of 10! Rivoli? Let me eat. <laughs> yeah, look, Yoshi. It's beef Rivoli. <laughs> That's a 10 out of 10 for sure. Wait, hold on. How can, how can he be a bird, but also be made of beef? Last time I checked, Rivoli was a bird, not a cow. You should have put chicken instead of beef ravioli or beef ravioli. It should have been chicken ravioli. Yeah, maybe, uh, maybe, maybe swap that out. Riley, swap that out for, uh, for chicken. For the top text, just replace that with chicken ravioli in tomato and meat sauce. Also, thanks for the shout out, Riley. I appreciate you. Telling people to come over to the stream. Yeah, no, it really does. Um, I'm trying to figure out how do I get the, the sheet. Wait, we already have the Sheikah sensor. But I want the Sheikah sensor plus, And I also want to get the rest of our runes taken care of. I want to get Stasis plus, Cryonis plus, Magnesis plus. Okay, so go back to where's it at? Uh, Zora's domain, Kekriko village, Hateno village. Go to that ancient tech lab, talk to Pura, and tell them that we have the other ancient tech lab up and running. And then hopefully she'll give me another follow up quest to unlock the rest of our stuff. Ancient materials? Oh no. Chat, we wasted all of our ancient materials on Robbie. Wow. Robbie robbed us literally in more ways than one. That's kind of sick right there though, chat. The Sheikah armor with the Sheikah slate glowing. That's cool. Sheikah slate authenticated, enhancing Sheikah sensor. All right, chat, where do we go when we when we get ancient cores at? Time for guardian farm hunting. Oh, not again. It took us two hours yesterday just to grind all these cores.
I mean, chat, after we beat the game, we should go back and 100% it. I just don't know if you guys want to sit there and watch me grind a hundred or 999 Koroks or do all of the shrines or collect all the armors. Maybe that's something I can do with members only once we unlock members. I have like 75,000 rupees in this game and I wish I could get that many in Tears of the Kingdom. I mean, you probably could have if you would have used the uh, the duplication glitch when the game first came out on version 0.01. All you had to do was just fly and drop a bunch of items on the ground and pick them back up. And then you could have just sold it to the guy at Terrytown. Yes, quite. So if you don't mind, how about showing Simon that spiffy Sheikah Sensor Plus later? Hello, you've acquired the Sheikah Sensor Plus. That should really come in handy. With that, you can sense things that you've captured with your camera. Explaining won't do it justice. Why not learn by trying? Uh, let's give it a shot, so to speak. Let's see here. First, go take a picture of Sunshroom with the camera. There is one beyond the lab. Also, we have bundled uh, duplication now, really. So wait, people are still finding ways to duplicate in Tears of the Kingdom? That doesn't surprise me. Oh, uh, well, I mean, then yeah, you'll probably never reach 75,000. Unless you grind for like the next two years straight. All right, chat, let's go take on some guardians. Time to go back to Hyrule Castle. Yeah, I don't, I, don't, I really don't even know why, why uh, Jacob needs 75,000 rupees. I guess just to have it. Nah, what Jacob should do is he should sit there and grind until he reaches a million rupees or 999,000 rupees. That's the way to go. Chat, do these uh, guardians over here glowing, do they drop ancient cores? Or is it only the ones that like chase after you? my uh my sword great that's just what i needed well chat it was nice knowing you i'm about to die by a guardian No, so when the Master Sword breaks, she doesn't have to wait 10 minutes. Oh, I see a Guardian. Please drop some cores. Question chat, if I use the Anti-Calamity arrows on... 
this guardian walking? Is it going to destroy it? Yo, it does. And it released the gloom from it. No ancient cores, though, sadly. Wait, you get, uh, you get ancient cores only if you shoot it in the eye? Chat, since we've been doing hunting of all the guardians, there's not too many that spawns around here anymore. Oh, you fixed the ravioli? All right, I'll check in here in a second. Drop the core! Please! Oh, are you serious? Ah, oh, I need to start reading chat better. They have bare ears. Alright, let me see. Let me check meme chat. <laughs> Chicken Rivali, let's go! That's funny. <laughs> Good job, Riley. They have bear ears? They do. What the heck? That fairy just moved that entire uh, wooden trunk. Yeah, ha ha, you found me. Chat, at some point, we gotta play uh, Tears of the Kingdom again. It does seem a little too soon to be playing it, though, because we just beat it seven months ago. Like, as much as I want to make a car out of Koroks. <laughs> what was Nintendo thinking when they uh, decided to add robot ancient robot spiders with lasers? I don't know. I would have loved to know their thought process. Like, they should have totally made a documentary on Breath of the Wild. Switch our arrows out for ancient arrows. Wait a minute. Oh, that helps out a ton. Look at me, Mr. Guardian. Guardian. Hey, you. Guardian. Guardian. Bro, how do you not see me? Bro, this Guardian is blind.
Got it. Right in the eye. Yes, we got a core. That's what I'm talking about. Skeleton horse. I want that. Mine. Yeah, do we take the wait what? <gasps> no! Why did you die? Oh, it'll it'll die once daybreak. That sucks. Oh, you can't even register it at a stable? That sucks even worse. All right, new guardian acquired. We need three cores and we have only two arrows left. This is bad. I'm being attacked by Tegan. No, I missed! No! <laughs> Tegan Choo Choo! It got in my way! Reload the save? Nah, it's fine. I have enough uh, money to go back to the ancient tech lab and get more arrows. It's not uh, like the end of the world, you know? You'd be embarrassed uh, that you just died to a choo choo. I mean, I, I didn't die to a choo choo though. We almost did though. Keegan reference. Okay, we are now broke, but we have 25 ancient arrows. And we have a dead guardian right outside of here. Uh, where is the guardian? 
There should have been a guardian here, right? There was one here earlier. Interesting. Better than nothing? Yeah. Oh, Master Sword's back. Where's the Guardian? Also, chat, where it, um, where's the hideout? Where's Koga's hideout? I want to go fight Koga. Master Koga. Your impression of here's the kingdom, it has failed. Oh, it's a shrine. Isn't it out in the desert, though? Out in the Gerudo? It's in the Gerudo. I wonder if it has anything to do with the Kaz, uh, Kaz's riddle. Cass at Cass was over here, right? <clears throat> yeah, he was over here on top of this tower. And they said we have to wait until the sun reaches a certain spot, right? The, to actually activate the uh, the shrine. Tower. I think that might be a better lookout spot. And yeah, and here's here's Cass as well. Yes, let's hear it. As light shines from the northwest skies. From the tower, shadow and arrow flies. Okay, it said an arrow from the tower. So that means once uh, light hits a certain spot, I assume we shoot the arrow towards the area down there.
I mean, chat, we found Robin Williams in Tears of the Kingdom. Wait, the shadow from the tower is moving. the um where's the bottom of that shrine at chat i need your guys's help here to let me know exactly when i should fire the arrow and where because i have no clue Where's even the shrine at? Oh, it's right there. Hopefully I don't miss my chance while I'm climbing back up the tower. Do I fire it at the shrine? Once this tower reaches over there? Breath of the Wild. Okay, so it says here. The light shines southwest skies and the tower shadow and an arrow flies. It says, when you land, light a fire with flint and wood, sit until night, and wait for the moon to intersect the Gerudo Tower. Okay. Wait, all this is just for a modest test of strength. It's not even worth my time. Master Yo uh, Koga at on the map. He is abandoned Hebra mine. This is Tears of the Kingdom.
Okay, Master Koga. And the leader of the Yiga clan, yeah. Oh, but you can actually get the, it says drops nothing, but killing will reveal a chest containing the Thunder Helm. Yiga clan hideout. The Yiga clan hideout is located north of the Gerudo Tower and southwest or southeast of Gerudo Summit in the Gerudo Highland or, or yeah Highlands. Right, Gerudo Highlands is here. There's... You're gonna go watch the platoon? All right. Oh, let me see. Okay, so we actually need to stand on the altar then. Okay, easy enough. We pretty much just stand here. And as soon as the moon hits that tip of this tower, we hit it with an arrow. says let's see Getting closer to it. I mean, it's not going to happen until nighttime. I believe right there is Koga. It is 2.45, yeah, it's gonna take a bit. So let's go back up to the top of the tower and fly over to Koga. We're gonna go take care of the hideout and then I'll probably end there. And then tomorrow we'll take care of some more stuff. We'll probably take on another guardian and then maybe do some loot hunting then and grab some more cool stuff and upgrades. Now we just have to climb our way all the way up to the top.
Oh wait, Link's gonna freeze to death. Hold on. Here we go. did way too much damage for my liking. I believe this is the hideout, right? <clears throat> Wait a minute. This is either the hide. Yeah, no, this is the hideout. Aha! We found it. Yeah, I thought this was that meant to happen. We're not supposed to go down there because we don't have the Thunder Helm quest done. Is that what's happening? Do I have to wait to be able to fight Koga? That would suck if we do. Because it said online that he has the Thunder Helm. Yeah, no, we cannot go down there. The game will not let us uh, proceed. Interesting. That's very strange. chat i think we're gonna end it here i think i don't know like i said before i'm only running off of three hours of sleep but i'm starting to get pretty tired i've been yawning this entire stream all right let's see <laughs> you're good um, I'm, I'm, I want to go to the Gerudo here, but I'm afraid when I do, it'll start the, the quest line, and I'd rather have that be for tomorrow. Get wrecked. Get wrecked. Ow! Oh no, oh no, I'm actually gonna die here.
right? So I ran into a whole camp full of those alphos. These are some tough ones too. If you're about to die, just eat 20 apples. You know what, chat? I have yet to grab one of these chests. Let's see what's in it. What kind of loot were these Lizalfos holding on to? A Gerudo spear. Eh, I'm good. Oh, well, you know what? I guess I guess Link took it anyways. Bazaar, where we can actually buy stuff. Let's save the game real fast. Just in case we die. You never know. $20 per arrow is crazy. That's wild. Huh, that's Breath of the Wild. <laughs> you know what? I'm starting to think MVL is starting to rub off on me. I'm making a whole lot more puns now. We did all that and we spent all that money for one single extra heart. Yeah, no, tomorrow we'll take on the Yiga clan hideout and take on the remaining uh, divine beast for the Gerudo. Who all is live right now? I hate that I have to restart my Chrome browser every single time that I try to see if someone's live because it doesn't update.
Let's see. Who all is live? Yeah, everyone's been playing Minecraft lately. Did I start getting into Minecraft? Yo, what's going on, Dread? I just don't play Minecraft anymore. I'm going to be real. I haven't played Minecraft since like 2011. I mean, I've been like trying to get into it because a lot of my friends have been trying to like get me to play Minecraft with them. And I'm like, I guess, but playing like modded Minecraft servers just doesn't really feel the same. <laughs> Bushido. Alright, so you've played Minecraft your whole life. I, I played during the early alpha all the way up to probably about the Xbox One early days. So like 2013-ish, 2011-ish. And then that's kind of where I kind of stopped playing. I kind of outgrew Minecraft. I mean, I guess you don't really ever truly outgrow Minecraft, but I did, sadly. Um, I heard Minecraft's changed a lot, though. So it might be cool to go back and try to, like, get some nostalgia out of it. Uh, let's see, who all is live right now, though? Uh, there's this new YouTuber. It's a, it's a comfy alpaca VTuber. She has 45 viewers right now. So she's a little bit of a bigger YouTuber. <clears throat> uh, we could go raid Chev. Chat, is Keegan streaming tonight? Chat, do you guys want to go watch some Final Fantasy VII Rebirth? Yeah, I'm going to stop here for now. Um, let's see. Minecraft Let's Play would get huge. Um, I don't know. Becca's playing her first ever playthrough through Pokemon Shield. All right, chat, your choices are... VTuber playing Minecraft, Chev Studio playing Rebirth, or we have Becca playing Pokemon Shield. We also have Azalea also playing Minecraft Bedrock. So we have two Minecrafters and we have two other uh, people. You know what, chat? Why don't we go raid Azalea? It's been a bit. Let's go to YouTube. The YouTube studio. Here we go. 
Hit save. All right, chat. If you guys are new here, also dread. If you, since you're new here, uh, how we raid is we do expl or hashtag lay monster raid, and you copy and paste this, and we spam this in their chat. And on that note, I will see you guys again tomorrow for some more Breath of the Wild and some Smash Brothers Ultimate. But until then, I will see you guys again tomorrow. Bye, guys!